Right, so today I'm going to do a little unboxing of these. These are cheap Amazon uh, LED uh, aquarium strips, light strips. Um, I say cheap, they were £43 each, whereas if you went for something like a, a Fluval or a well known make, you'd be paying one into hundreds of pounds. These are designed for fresh water. Um, they are literally as, as cheap as it gets. Um, just got them, just got them out of the box, or out of the wrapping. Um, from Amazon, and they are uh, just plain boxes. So let's see what you get inside for your money. Well, fairly well pack packaged. The cardboard's fairly sturdy. It's an inner liner, keeping everything together. Unlike normal when you buy Chinese stuff, these actually come with a three pin UK plug, which is a bonus. I was expecting to have to use converters and the power lead. The strip itself there you go. Surface mounted LEDs, now it's got two different um, settings controlled by a switch on the end one is uh, blue and the other one is just plain white they are uh, 25 watt IP67 rated and they are as you can see quite thin these are three foot they're actually to go on a six foot tank behind me um, Obviously, no one actually makes a six foot bulb, so I've had to go with uh, two three footers. And we have extendable brackets if you wish to extend them any further. Now, I'm going to have to use the legs a little bit to keep them off of, um, off, of the, off, off, off of the condensation trays. Now, immediately, the first thing you kind of notice about it, with one page of instructions, the first thing you'll notice, and I don't know if you've been able to hear it, is it's plastic on the top, it's not metal, this isn't a big heat sink, so these aren't really going to be very good for seriously high power. Um, what it is, is the tank currently runs 245 watt. T8 bulbs, uh, fluorescent tubes, um, and I'm hoping to replace it with these two 25 watt LED panels, which should hopefully give me a similar level of light, um, but greatly reduce the watt usage of the tank, the wattage usage. Um, so we'll see what these are like now. Power cables. One of the things that always bugs me with lights is the power cables that come on the uh, drivers are normally quite short, which when you're dealing with a six foot tank can cause you an issue, but this, when it's all combined, is fairly long, probably looking at a good part of two metres. Um, which do is we'll quickly uh, power this one up, check for dead LEDs and we can show you what it's like brightness wise. So that's your blues. They're all there. There's uh, what six banks of two, and that's your white. Now the whites also have the blues turned on as well. So this is the remote that it'll be running. 
and then I can see straight away from looking at it, you can't really see it on the camera, but I can see that they are all active. Just to give you an example of just how bright it is, I'll just take the lights off. That's your blues again. You're looking at a fair amount of blue and white. And again, full bar. So that's it, cheap, cheerful. Uh, Amazon LED lights. Um, now I'm not expecting quality of them to be amazing. I'm not expecting them to last 10 years like some of the more expensive ones do with TMCs and whatnot. But at the price for cost, you've got to remember you can uh, have four of these for the price of one of a more reputable brand. Um, and yes, yeah, so I'm hopefully gonna get these on the six footer in a minute and we'll uh, we'll see what we look like once it's lit up right so both lights are now on and as you can see two little 25 watt LEDs give off more than enough light if anything that's actually brighter and there's more light than there was off the old T8s now it's a bit colder it's more bluey white, it's more cold white um, compared to the T8s which were more of a, a pinkly purpley colour, the um, sun glow um, uh, was a type of bulbs before but um, as you can see it works well we've got some nice coverage of the plants and the fish um, we've just had a little bit of a feed so they're out and about yeah that's uh so fall in two lights um just under 90 quid delivered um i'm very happy with that result that's uh, a very satisfactory outcome for the lights and as you can see it's covers all parts even the uh even the size and the edges okay so yeah, not bad, not bad. Um, if you're looking for budget lights, I would certainly uh, recommend them. I think these, there's a load of different makes basically, they're all the same, uh, white box labelled um, from different Chinese manufacturers. These ones were Aquarian Eco or something like that. Um, and these are two three foot um, strips, light bars, um, 72 LEDs on each, 25 watts each. So yeah, not bad.